Welcome. Um, this is a short demonstration about what's new in our latest book edition. Um, as you've been aware that we have now opened our source code repository, meaning that the indicator source code is now available for different platforms. Today I want to show you the example that we also started to integrate TradingView scripts and so that you can use our cyclic indicators on the TradingView platform. To show you this, let's now um, shortly switch to TradingView. So if you're online, you can open charts. For example, we just use the Bitcoin US dollar chart here and show you now that we started to make our indicators available also on TradingView. So for example, if you want to use our uh, cyclic smooth RSI indicator, um, just browse the indicator library by TradingView. And you will see here that from when to trade, you have now the RSI Cyclic Smooth, which is introduced in our book. So please read the book first to know what you're doing here. And afterwards, you feel free just to add this indicator to your charts on a trading view. So what you see here down below now is the Cyclic Smooth RSI indicator on the trading view Bitcoin chart right opened here with just one mouse click. So first of all, this is the smoothed and enhanced version of the RSI. But as you know, the second important thing is to tune the RSI indicator by the dominant cycle. So in order to detect the current dominant cycle, you need to, to use different tools. For example, the Cycle Explorer, um, our API integration, or even other usages. But first of all, the easiest way is just to move over to over to over to our uh, homepage wentotrade.com and we provide an overview about the current dominant market cycles here day by day so you can use our dashboard to have a quick overview about the current dominant cycles and you see for cryptocurrencies we also provide the bitcoin dominant cycle day by day so um, you also can use this service in our briefing email and our briefing service covers much more symbols than here you could do this on your own uh, with the cycle explorer however we are interested in the current cycle length which is shown here so at the day we're doing this the current active dominant cycle has a length of 60 bars on a daily chart so we will move back to our Bitcoin chart and the cyclic smoothed RSI indicator and now change the length setting to the dominant cycle length, which we have seen from our dashboard uh, with a value of 30. So now you will see the optimized version and including now the dominant cycle length. And now you see based on the indicator that you have a clear turn below the dynamic bands here. So we have a nice entry signal on Bitcoin based on the cyclic RSI and you see here now that uh, we have the divergence uh, at the area of the upper bands here from the cyclic RSI so you see here um, a divergence between price uh, and indicator and the turn here which indicated the down move here uh, based on the RSI we have the up signal here and you see here these uh, upturns so we have here the high I um, alert, alert indication here. So what you see here is the smooth RSI. We can just add the standard um, RSI to compare both indicators to get a quick view. So this is now the standard RSI. Uh, let's do the same length setting here so that you get a quick view about our enhanced version, which is much more smooth and sharper in regards to the turns and the standard RSI here which has a lot of whipsaw signals here and even no signal at all because if you look at the dynamic bands, it's below the dynamic bands, which exactly matches to the turn. And here there's no signal on the normal RSI. So this is just a short introduction to show you that you now can start to use the indicators on TradingView. Just open indicators, um, go to RSI, cyclic smooth, and you will find the one. Um, yeah, if you like it, just um, like the indicator or something like this. So you can even see more on the indicator here. So please um, just view this indicator on your uh, TradingView account. It's described here. Uh, like it if you like it or comment it. So feel free. So this is just a short update. This is just one thing that's new in addition to our new book